Well, the business had been going for about 20 years and uh, we'd done a number of different iterations of a rebrand during that time. Uh, but we felt as though we needed something to freshen it up. Uh, we'd got into a new partnership with LinkedIn and part of that was a lot of marketing on their platform, which took us onto the global uh, scale, really. And so um, we looked at bringing an agency in that we thought was really going to be able to get under the skin of what we are and what we do and, um, and take our business forward. The reason why a lot of businesses uh, enter into a rebranding process is essentially because, for whatever reason, um, the models changed, the offerings changed, what they say uh, about themselves has changed uh, out with of reality. So, so that the whole point of this process for us is to is to realign what the business is saying about itself uh, to what it does and how it does it. But when you actually bring people into the business, they've got to get what our organisation's about very quickly. And values, I think, help do that. There's one that's, that, that, that sticks out in my mind all the time. It's sure-footedness. And the, you know, that isn't a word that you or I would use every day. No. Uh, but it did just encompass a number of different facets of what we're all about. Uh, we know where we're heading. Uh, we understand uh, the importance of doing that with a, a sense of... Um, Sure-footedness. <laughs> <laughs> and stoicism and yes. focus and so on and so forth. But yeah, it's a great word. It was a great word that came out of it. Sure-footed. Absolutely love that. So we knew exactly what the business stood for uh, based on the questions that Martin had, answer, had asked us. And um, it helped us then bring that together in terms of values and vision so that um, all of our staff within the business who might not have been involved in the initial process could then see what we were all about. So we ended up with a strap line of recruitment done properly. We got to that at the end of the, the workshop. It didn't mm. come four weeks later after a number of people who hadn't been in the workshop analysed all the data and that sort of thing. I'd just like to say that, that doesn't always happen. <laughs> but we, but. Came, we came up with what we were entirely happy with at the end and, and it's exactly what we've been using. Yeah. But the nice thing was they took recruitment done properly and they went, yeah, that's us, back into the office and they held, held other people accountable. Mm. So made sure that we did recruitment properly. We followed the process. Mm. And the process means that it works. Mm. The ultimate objective of this branding process uh, wasn't just to create a new website and create a new logo. It was actually to make our business more successful. And uh, as a sales business, everything that we do has to contribute to that, uh, whether it's the right process or whether it's looking the right way and saying the right things. And uh, we've seen a massive increase in the number of people that have applied directly through our site, which is probably the most important measurement. Uh, but also the quality of those has been particularly good. So what that's telling me is we're saying the right things to the people that are coming to our site to make them want to come and apply to us. So the feedback uh, from the the, the external perception of the workshop, which is obviously what people see on our website and on our printed material and that sort of thing, has been outstanding, uh, particularly through the website, because that is our biggest channel, I guess, now. Uh, we've had such positive feedback that the rebranding process is obviously demonstrating to our market, i.e. marketing, digital and creative people, that we understand their industry. And um, to be able to do that through a brand and through the tone of voice and the words that you use, I think is, I think is quite powerful. Mm. Yeah. So the process is, is tried and tested and fine-tuned now and essentially it's designed just to get the best sound bites out of these guys uh, and that's how we craft the whole thing off the back of that. What was magical about this process was um, that we had so much to talk about, you know, 20 years of history of how we've done things and the people we've employed, the clients we've done work with, the candidates we've found jobs for, um, that Martin managed to bring all of those back to just a handful of key focal points that we could really then focus on, and that's what was the DNA of our business.